Hi everyone, um, my name is Ruby, my pronouns are they and them. I'm a 29 year old at the moment project manager and advocate uh, for the LGBTIQA plus and disability communities. I'm non-binary, I'm autistic, I'm very, very bisexual, I'm a nerd, but I think what makes me me is everything that's taken to get to the point where I can be comfortable with all of that. My name's Jordan, I am a volunteer and broadcaster here at Joy. I host Homophonics, which is 9 o'clock on Monday nights. It is a queer music show, so it's a show dedicated to showcasing queer artists from around the world with a big focus on local artists. Hi, I'm Dean R. Curie and I'm a busy homosexual, I think is the best description for me. I'm a cabaret comedian, journalist, photographer, artist, just generally a really busy gay. I do a lot of things and I love it. Hello, I'm David Hunt. Apart from being co-host on Friday Drive with Sue Wilkinson, 10 years, yay. I'm also co-host and part of a team on Sunday Arts Magazine, three to five on a Sunday afternoon. We support um, the art scene here in Victoria and around the world. And 85% of our people we interview are from the LGBTIQ community. Hi there, my name is Annie Louie. I present Annie and Ando. I'm one half of the Drive Duo on Mondays and I also present Melbourne's Most Uplifting Music Mix on Thursday mornings. I've got a journalism background and I also started doing stand-up comedy when I was 16. So I'm an ally, I'm a woman of colour as well. I've got a Chinese background. I think we are all made up of experiences. That is what it means to be human. So everything that I've experienced in my life makes me unique and makes all of our Joy listeners unique as well. Hey Joysters, I'm Robbie Molinari from Friday Night's Turn the Beat Around. Um, I came to Joy about seven years ago when I first moved to Melbourne in 2012 now. Um, I started volunteering at the front desk, put in a proposal for a radio program, um, and eventually got a slot on a Friday night, which I continue to host. Uh, it's a uh, collection of 70s and 80s disco music and some funk and soul stuff as well from the same era artists. And over the past 12 months of me, um, of me doing the show, I've had the opportunity to interview some incredibly talented musicians and it has just been so fun discovering them for myself but also allowing the world to discover them. So all the work that I've been able to do and all the space I've been able to make for bi plus people and for LGBTIQ plus people with disabilities, particularly those of us who are neurodiverse, all of that's come from joy. Um, all that's come from joy giving, from some from joy making a space for, for me um, and for bi plus people and letting me have a voice in there. I remember when Joy started. I remember sneaking up into my bedroom and listening to the radio those those couple of days or a week here or there on the school holidays when Joy was broadcasting. And yes, I was like, yay, there's music, but I got to hear a part of my community. And the fact that the station has grown so much to now be 24 seven out loud and proud and that I can be a part of that means everything. I love that I've made so many amazing friends through Joy. Um, and that happened from the day I walked in there. And the fact that I'm doing it at, a, at an LGBTI organization makes it even more special because that's who I am and that's who I am proud to be. And, and I wouldn't want to be presenting my program on any other type of station. Joy is a very special place for me and I'm very, very thankful it exists. Come on, support Joy because we are you and you are us. Thank you, see ya.